Hi guys, how are we doing? Um, what I'm going to be doing today is I'll give a wee quick run in the garden and maybe ask for your advice and some things but this is the second um, bag of Epicure potatoes, what we call Yorkshire potatoes that need as you can see they're, they're, they're dead, they're gone um, and I don't know if it's going to be any better than the last crop but we'll take all these off to begin with and then we'll tip it into the green bucket that'll get the compost bin right so I'll tip these into the bucket and then I'll get back to these right okay well, as you can see by the bottom, there's no much there at all. Oh, there we go. That one was no bad size, but uh, is that the more? Is that all I'm gonna get? Just the one? Hmm, there's the seat on. There's. Oh no. They're a better size than the ones I've done the last time, well, we'll admit, well, maybe no. But, as long as I get a dinner, and keep some, I'll probably keep that one and maybe that one for next year's seeds. That can go in the bin. Definitely gonna get a, a dinner with it, so let's put all this in back in that bag just now. I'll be getting kept for next year's potatoes. Hmm. These wee potatoes, see them? See, putting them in soup, like I'll make a pot of broth and they'll go in just like that. Oh, and then you just get a wee, a nice, real lovely surprise when you bite into it. It's lovely. I think this is going to take me a wee while to get through all this. So, what we'll do is I will pause the video and I will come back to you if it's what I actually got out of it. Okay, mine now. Yeah, there you go. That's a better harvest than we got the last time. Um, so I've been off there for a couple of dinners for me and the missies. And these ones here will be probably next year's seeds. And that's that. But there is something I want to show you. If we come over here, now this is my calabrese. It's supposed to be a big head of broccoli, and I don't know if it's actually bolted or it's sprouting broccoli. I don't know. The vod on it, that one, that one. I mean that looks like sprouting broccoli. I think I've got the wrong seeds from Premier Seeds. Um, so these are bolted. I do have some cauliflowers as you can see there. I've got one there and one here. So I'm going to rip these out because... Look at that one. And that one because this is broccoli and cauliflower here these are spares that I put in seeds that I put in so they'll be getting transferred over uh, bolted ready to flower that's charred 
and if we come in here you'll notice that the turn up <sighs> see that dog the turn up is all flubbered it's all bolted so this is all going to get ripped out and fresh seeds put in and we'll try again um, that over there is all cauliflower and broccoli that's one Brussels sprout because I'm the only one that eats them so we only need the one and this is cabbage and I'm starting to think maybe that's bolted as well so this is turned up all bolted so it's coming out go in the compost heap and I'll put fresh seeds in Alfie! Cabbage. I'll leave in just now, see what happens. I need to it. Alfie! I need to tie up that brush with a brow. Oh, I nearly failed you. Um, and this full bucket of lettuce is going to go in the compost bin because the wife's decided she doesn't want to eat the lettuce for the garden. She would rather have it in a packet out of Tesco's. So all of that lettuce and all of the other lettuce, I'll leave the, the other lettuce, I'll, I'll eat the small one, but all of that's gone in the compost bin. Um, the carrots are coming up well, they're doing okay. Onions are growing, beetroot doesn't seem to be doing anything special. It's not forming any bulbs at the bottom, so I'm wondering if it's bolted, bolt hardly, beetroot bolted. There you go. The reason I'm keeping all these sticks is because they'll get shredded at the end of the season. Hold on, I need to go and see my dog. So, this is cabbage seeds, but I don't think I'll need them. And turnip seeds, but I will need them. So tonight's tea or dinner is, here's your potatoes, broccoli, We've got a cauliflower in the fridge, we'll probably have that. A bit of chicken and some pike sauce maybe. I don't know. Um, and my garlic. And my garlic, I'll take you down like you see it. I don't know whether to lift it or no. Um, it's been really, really wet here for the past week. Um, it's not, it's starting to turn, but it hasn't turned yet. I mean, these are all still green, and I don't know whether they lift it, or maybe I just left one just to see. Um, I don't know what to do. I'll lift one and see what it's like. What it's walking about. I'll see if I can do it one handed. Did I lift one of these ones? I think I'll lift one of these ones. I don't know if you can see that. Oh. oh, look at that size. What utter rubbish. Yeah, I think we'll leave it in then. I'll let it go until it's. I thought it would have been bigger than that. And this is the stuff from the garlic farm. I'll not be buying for them again, I'll tell you that. Okay. So, this season of gardening, so far, has been pretty rubbish, pretty poor. The peas are nice, I like them. 
the cauliflower, uh, the broccoli I'm going to have to redo. Oh, I hope the cauliflower is okay, because I can see a couple of heads. I haven't touched my Maris Piper potatoes yet. I've ate all my strawberries, they were lovely. And I'll leave the garlic just now, see what happens. Okay, anyway, thanks for watching. Please stay safe, and I'll catch you on the next one.